Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be filming um, a kind of Sunday vlog with me. Um, I'm filming, editing, and uploading today for my Sunday upload. So today I thought, since you guys really like when I do grocery hauls, so I thought I would take you around with me as I do my little Sunday routine. I'm gonna be going to the grocery store for my family. They're at a hockey game right now, so I'm going to the grocery store. And then I'm gonna pick up the groceries, bring it home, do a haul, and then I have laundry to do. I did my eyebrows and I did mascara before I left the house, so I didn't put any makeup on today. But now I'm thinking that I look crazy. I don't look as crazy if I'm in the mirror, but it looks crazy on camera. Anyway, it is what it is. I'm gonna be putting a mask on when I get to the grocery store, and when I get home, I'll put some foundation on so I don't look as crazy. Um, but yeah, so going to the grocery store, I have a list of stuff that I'm going to get for the week. I have our meals planned out for the week, what we're gonna have for dinners, and then also I'm going to actually meal prep for lunches this week. Um, I've been really into either smoothies or um, oats. Um, over, not overnight oats, baked oats. That's what I've been really into. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a really cloudy day here where I'm living. I'm really into the Taylor Swift Fearless album, the new version of it. So I'll probably listen to that while I drive and I'll go to the grocery store. I forgot my AirPods and I'm not going back in the house cause I just put the dog in the kennel and he's being good and he didn't bark, which is like really good. I'm glad he's like not barking when I put him in the kennel anymore, which is awesome. I'll also give you a Frank update. Anyway, I'm going to go to the grocery store and I will see you when I am back in from the grocery store. All right. Okay. All right, so I'm done at the grocery store. That took like 30 minutes. It wasn't that busy, so it was nice to get in and out. I got lots of stuff that I will do a haul in when I get home. But yeah, it was actually, I, like I said before, I really don't hate doing grocery hauls. I'm actually a gal who loves to go to the grocery store as long as I have a list um, and there's nobody annoying in the grocery store. Sometimes other people can ruin my grocery shopping experience. So I'm gonna drive home, which should take like five minutes. I'm gonna let the dog out because he'll probably have to pee and then I will do my grocery haul, showing you what I got at the grocery store, tips and tricks, all that kind of stuff, because I, like I said, I love to go to the grocery store. All right, I'm gonna put on some Taylor Swift. karaoke sesh on the way home to Taylor Swift's album. It's even better as when it was when I was like 12 or 13. So much better now. Anyway, so I'm gonna take all my stuff into the house and I'm by myself loading all the stuff in and I mean, that's gonna be fun. Hi, Hi baby. Hi, I came back. Do you wanna go out to pee? Yeah, good boy. Good boy, Frank. Okay, let's go pee. Good boy, no barking. Good boy. Let's go, Bubba. Come on, Bubs. Oh, dear, good boy. Good boy, Frank. <gasps> Look at your baby. Hi, Frank. Hi, Frank. Are you kissing the camera? Look at the groceries. Are you sniffing them out? You wanna go do a grocery haul first? Hey guys, welcome back. So, I just finished unloading, or uh, getting the groceries inside. The dog is outside, sitting out on the front, front deck, which he loves to do. So I just thought I would do a quick little grocery haul, tell you what I got, what my plans are for food this week, like what our meals are. For me, I got myself a Brita, because this is the one the, for the fridge downstairs. 
which is right next to my room. So I got this Brita filter because I'm always like in the middle of the night, like thirsty and I want cold water that tastes good. So I'm just gonna plan on filling this up and just leaving it down in the basement. So also when friends are over and stuff, I can just have water. So I bought that myself. And then also on my go, I got some raw almond butter. Mara Natha is the brand and it is creamy um, almond butter. I don't like peanut butter, but I do like almond butter. So my plan is to put this in smoothies and then also put it on top of my cooked oats when I'm done cooking them, um, my baked oats, I guess. Um, but I'm going to do a video on how I specifically like have perfected my oats and like different ways that you can make it because um, I've really perfected it. I do, this morning I had dark chocolate oats with, um, berries on the top and I thought oh my goodness would an almond butter just make such a great addition to that so that's why I got this as well cold brew I do have a cold brew maker but I wanted something that I could store my cold brew and once I'm done so I bought this plus I haven't made some in a while um and I really wanted some right now because it takes 24 hours to make my cold brew so I got this Stoke is one of my favorite cold brew brands this is the unsweet version I got some coconut bliss sweet cream this is plant-based um, and dairy-free, so that's why I like it. Ow, I just hit myself. This stuff is really good. I like it a lot. I also like the caramel version. Then I got some silk almond milk. This is the unsweetened vanilla flavor. This is my favorite. I've drank this stuff for years, and I like it a lot. And then I got three cans of our compliments, coconut milk, and this is what we put in our rice to make it creamy and smooth. Um, and it's great. It has so many different benefits to it. Coconut milk is a really great way to add like flavor to your rice. Then I got some sour cream. This is my favorite. This is the farmer's 18% restaurant style. This one is my favorite. Then I got some feta cheese because I'm going to make some more tomato feta pasta. This is just the feta cheese, just regular feta cheese. Um, so I'm trying to get back into that because I love it and it's so good. And then I also got some cream cheese because I'm going to be making walking taco this week. I got, this is a really good if you are gluten free but you still want pasta. Um, this is the brown rice pasta and this is in the elbow kind of pasta. Um, I love this brand. This is my favorite gluten free pasta. I'm not gluten free but I do um, if possible try to have as much gluten free stuff um, <laughs> as I can. I mean I still eat pizza like I'm not perfect. I'm definitely like not celiac or anything like that but I just try to reduce the amount, amount of gluten that I do have but this is great and um, yeah it's not mushy and it doesn't have a weird taste because it's brown rice it's definitely not keto but um, I'm not keto so it doesn't matter but anyway this stuff is really good I got some hamburger buns these are the Odo's hamburger buns and I've had their bagel thins before and they're really good um, and I heard um, like a naturopath talking about these and said that they're pretty good like they're very low um, they have a low amount of ingredients, which is good to look for when you're looking for gluten-free products because there's so many like different things with gluten-free products that aren't good for you. So um, because barbecue season is coming upon us, I want to have some gluten-free barbecue like burger buns and stuff. So yeah, you can even use these probably for sandwiches and stuff too if you wanted to. These are something new that I got. These are um, heat and eat 100% white corn like little tortillas so I like to make tacos um, and these ones are whole wheat so they do have grain in them so I thought that these would be good they're gluten free I don't even know if they're going to be good but they look like pretty traditional type of like corn tortillas so I thought this would be good because we're gonna have fajitas this week and then we're also going to have either tacos or something like that so I wanted to get these and try them out see if they're good but I'll let you know if I like them or not um hopefully they're good because I think there's like 20 or so in these so anyway i'm gonna try these and i'll let you know if i like them and i just got some two pizza doughs just that are compliments pizza doughs they're pretty good um i got some sour cream and onion chips for my mom those are her favorite chips i got some hamburger because we're going to be making walking taco this week i got some eggs and then green onion got some romaine lettuce for salad we got some bananas Got some blueberries and I'm gonna put these in my overnight overnight oats this week and then tomatoes for my tomato feta pasta got some avocados so avocado toast or tacos or really anything guacamole got some bell peppers 
red and orange, probably for general tayo. Broccoli, because I'm gonna be meal prepping for lunches this week. So I'm gonna do broccoli, sweet potato, and chicken. And then onions, red onion, mushrooms, and sweet potato. All right, so that's everything. That's really not that huge of a grocery haul considering we're a family of four. Um, so this week we're going to be doing butter chicken, walking taco. That's what we're going to be doing for supper this week. I hope you like this grocery haul. Let's go check on Frank and see how he is doing. I even have my little ring light set up so I had good lighting because my kitchen is so dark. So let's go see Frank. He's being really quiet. He's so good. Oh, look at the baby. Are you sleeping? Will you say hi to the camera? Say hi, Frank. Who's that? Who's that cute boy? Oh, oh, the little paw. Hi. Who's that good boy? Who's that? Is that Frank? Hi, baby. Were you a good boy? Did you have a nice nap? Yeah, you're sweet. Is that you? Oh, your baby. Oh, you're such a good boy. Hey, oh, are you good? You look at the camera? Oh, you're so sweet. Oh. Snuggles? So Frank is a really good boy. He loves to snuggle. Only at certain times of the day. In about another hour, he has his witching hour where he just runs around and barks um, <laughs> for about an hour or two. Oh, big stretch. Oh, he's so sweet. It's not much longer and he'll be able to do this. I think he's like probably 20 pounds now. He's so hard to carry, but he does love to cuddle and he is really good. He loves to be outside like all day by himself um, and because I work from home he can just kind of chill outside which is nice um, and he gets to spend all day with me which is nice so I get to spend all the puppy time with him right am I talking about you and he's so he is really good and he's getting better at not having accidents in the house which is really nice and uh, yeah he's a sweetie he really is yeah and it's so funny, he has a bedtime. His bedtime is 10 o'clock every night. And if it's like 9.50 and he's just overtired, you know, he'll just run around and cry and he just wants to go to bed. And as soon as you put him to bed, he's just out. He doesn't whine or anything. Do ya? Do you wanna go on my hip? Oh, it's a baby. Oh, you're so sweet. He loves to go right over your shoulder too. You're cute. You're so cute. But Frank does not like to go for walks either. Do you, Frank? Do you, you want to show them your new collar? Frank got a new collar too today because he outgrew his collar and he outgrew his kennel. But he got a big kennel that you guys saw. And then he, um, yeah. Oh, oh, to baby. He got a new collar and a new tag that says Frank. And it says our address and stuff in case he gets lost. But if you live in PEI, if um, you see this guy running around, um, call the number on there. He doesn't really leave our property because he's scared of going for a walk. Are you shy? You being shy? But yeah, if you see this black and white big dog running around named Frank, pick him up and give me a call because he shouldn't be running by himself. Right, baby? but you haven't even left a property by yourself. Oh, okay, well thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed the grocery haul and the little Frank update. He is so sweet. He's barking outside right now while I end this. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. You guys seem to really like grocery hauls and I love doing grocery hauls. That's like all I watch on YouTube is like grocery hauls, cleaning and hauls. So, and that's what I'm gonna be coming. Um, but thank you so much for watching and please like, comment, subscribe and maybe share this video with someone who you think might like it. Um, so uh, more people can watch my videos. Okay, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.